Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. On this video, I will share how to make a light and crispy waffles. I hope you enjoy. So guys, for this recipe, I'll be using some milk, eggs, vanilla extract. I've got some salt here, baking powder, vegetable oil, soft raising flour. Now feel free to use all purpose flour or plain flour, it's completely fine. And I've also got here some sugar. So for more information, please check out the description box below and I'll go through the measurements throughout the video. Guys, just to let you know, for the milk, I didn't use the regular liquid milk. So I mixed water with powdered milk. I like it like this, it's just a personal preference. You can feel free to use a regular milk. So first thing first, I'll start with mixing all the dry ingredients together. So I'm just sifting the flour to remove any lumps so it can be smooth. Next I'll add in 140 grams of sugar, half a teaspoon of baking powder and a bit of salt. Then mix it well well together. After it's all mixed, put it aside. Moving on, I'm now separating the egg yolk and the white. guys. This will make something magical happen when we're making the waffles. Trust me, trust me. Next, I'll mix the liquid ingredients together. So I've got here one and a half cup of milk, which works out about 450 milliliters. Then I'm gonna add in the egg yolk and mix, mix it well together, honey. After it's all mixed, I'm adding 150 milliliters of vegetable oil. Now you can feel free to add in melted butter if you like, it's completely fine. Then mix, mix, mix it all well together. Then add a teaspoon of vanilla extract and mix. This is gonna make it taste, mm, oh la la. It's gonna give it that uh, special taste, you know what I mean? So now I'm going to whisk the egg whites. This will make the waffle light, fluffy and crispy. So I'm just mixing it until it becomes fluffy. Et voila, it's nice and foamy. So guys, this is my favorite part when you mix everything together. The smell is just, oh, it's just amazing. So we're mixing the dry ingredients and the liquid. So just stir it together. As you add the liquid in, just keep stirring it mix mix and mix so when you leave the egg white for too long this is what happened guys it starts to turn liquid please don't do what I did mix the mixture together then beat the egg white so I had to take out the electric beater because my arm was just hurting whisking it so it just does the magic so it's back to being fluffy so yeah guys beat the egg white just before you're about to add it in so as you can see here, I'm just folding it in, folding it in, just to let the air in. It's just going to be amazing. This is what's going to help our waffles to be light and fluffy and crispy. And also, while you're mixing it in, turn your waffle machine on because things are about to go down in here. So when the machine is hot, you can go ahead and brush it with some oil or some cooking spray. This will make it easy to come off when it's done. Next, I'll pour the mixture using a cooking spoon. Don't pour too much because it just overlaps and it gets too messy. I cook these for five minutes to have that golden brown color. Then take them out and repeat the same process with the rest. Just look at it guys, they are so light, I love it. Guys, these are great when it's served hot. I literally ate these as I was making them, seriously. They are so light and crispy. You can enjoy this alone, which I mostly do, or with ice cream and fruit. Also, like I did here, with some honey and icing sugar. Thank you very much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a big like, share with your friends and family, subscribe and press the notification bell if you haven't, so you can be up to date with my videos. I'll speak to you all soon. Bye bye.